What's going on everyone, Alex here and welcome back to the channel and today we are talking about this camera. That's right, we are talking about the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera 4K. I've got it rigged out right here, this is my new camera and it is a beast of a camera. The fact that it can do RAW internally as well as ProRes has me super, super psyched. The image quality out of this camera is absolutely stunning. I've only had the camera for about a week, but what I've captured with it has blown my mind. Everyone raves about the image quality out of Blackmagic cameras, and rightfully so, because it does produce some amazing looking images. As I stated earlier, it shoots RAW and ProRes internally. And Caleb Pike from DSLR Video Shooter said it best when he said, this is a poor man's red. And he is absolutely 100% right. I will say the build quality of the camera does leave more to be desired. It has kind of a plasticky feel. It, it doesn't have that kind of premium feel that you would expect out of a cinema camera. But like a red, if you want to fully utilize this camera, you do have to rig it out like a red. And after you rig it out, this camera screams. I mean, it, it literally, it screams. I currently have a pair with a Metabone Speed Booster Ultra, the Pocket 4K version. It has that rear element that just protrudes ever so slightly, gets a little closer to the sensor, and overall produces a sharper image. Originally, I did have it paired with a Viltrox Speed Booster, and let's just say I'll have a video on that next week. And I know some of you are probably wondering why I didn't go with the Pocket 6K version instead, since Blackmagic decided to knock $500 off of it. What? And really it comes down to the fact that it has an EF mount. Nothing against the EF mounts because I have all EF lenses, but I like the fact that I could adapt as many lenses I want to with the Pocket 4K. Also, I just don't really need 6K. I feel like it's a little too much. And yes, the battery life is terrible. The LPE6 batteries don't last very long, 45 minutes, 50 minutes at best, but I knew that going into it, and that's why I paired it with a V-mount battery. And when it's paired with a V-mount battery, it lasts forever. 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 Another thing that had me stoked on this camera, apart from the raw internal and ProRes, was the menus. Everything I read and researched on this camera said the menus were a joy to use, and yes, yes they are. They're an absolute joy to use. I love Blackmagic's menu system. They knocked it out of the park. It's, in my opinion, probably better than Canon's, and that's saying a lot because Canon's menu system is right up there. It's right up there. Canon menus, Blackmagic menus. I don't make these rules, that's just how it is. I'd say the biggest thing that sets this camera apart from, let's say, a RED, is the fact that it has a screen built into the camera a five inch touch screen, mind you, and it is awesome. It's so responsive and it's so easy to use with Blackmagic's menus. As great as it is having a five inch touch screen built into the camera, it's a fixed touch screen, so kind of a downside. That's why I'd recommend getting an external monitor. And finally, the biggest reason that everyone loves this camera is the fact that you can shoot raw internally. Blackmagic raw, in fact, and I love it. The fact that you can shoot compressed raw like 12 to one, eight to one, five to one, three to one, is, is amazing and that just makes me more excited to use the camera. Seriously, I am super stoked to use this camera. Cannot wait to shoot more docs. I feel like this is gonna be an amazing camera for docs. Well, that wraps up this little review video. If you can call it a review video, I've only had the camera for about a week, but if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, subscribe if you aren't already, tap the notification bell so you can be notified when I upload a new video, and if you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. Until next time, shoot to create.